Hey guys, we're back. Um, Nia is all fresh and clean. Show them your outfit, Nia. Yeah, I'm fresh and clean. Look, check out these socks. They are tennis shoe socks. Okay? With laces. So, when I don't feel like fighting with shoes, she can still have some on with her socks. Okay, um, to review the Shea Moisture Baby Line products, um, I'll start with the shampoo, the wash and shampoo. Um, now this is avocado and shea butter, olive and marula. I don't know what marula is, I need to look it up. But yeah, um, now when I washed your hair with it, it, it did make it a little hard, okay? And she has very soft hair. So it made it a little hard, um, but once I rinsed it out, it it did feel soft. Like after I rinsed it and dried it, it was softer. It was soft, not, you know, it was soft, um, softer than when I was washing it. But it did. It, this did make her hair a little hard. Um, again, this is the olive and marula head to toe baby wash and shampoo and it has uh, avocado and sh shea butters in it um yeah so I didn't like it at first you know when I washed her hair because it made it hard but then afterwards I was like oh okay well it's soft when I dry it but I, I don't know why it made her hair hard um but yeah and this is the ointment for raw and irritated skin she scratches her head a lot and she can't get sores in her head, so I put that on there. Um, I don't know if this is necessarily for... Oh, by the way, the fragrance... Of the I don't like the fragrance of this. It's like a strong, musky smell. I, I don't like that for her. I, w I don't like it for me either. But it's a really strong smell, um, the shampoo. Okay, now, um, the ointment, um, it's really thick. It's like a maybe five times thicker than Vaseline but like once you rub it it's like this thick oil kinda um, uh, consistency and that's fine for me I like thickness because she does have eczema as well so thick oils are fine um, this smells better than the shampoo yeah like I can do this I can do this um, I put it on her hair and it was really thick, and I, like, massaged it into her scalp, you know, where she has, um, the dry skin, aww, and the, uh, scabs from her scratching her head, um, but, um, yeah, this I can do. I don't know if I would necessarily replace what I'm doing. I'm using this, like, shea butter, Vaseline, and a little tiny bit of Cetaphil for her hair, or her scalp, and, um, some coconut oil. I don't know if I would replace that, but, um, if I had this, I mean, I'd use it. I don't necessarily, I wouldn't replace what I have going on right now, but I like this. I'm going to, I'm going to use this up. This, um, the shampoo and body wash, I don't think, I, like, I'll try it again, but I, I don't, I really don't like the smell, and then it made her hair hard, um, at first initially so I may tr I'm going to try it one more time but I don't really like this one okay but this ointment is cool the ointment's cool um you can see her hair I shouldn't have put the bow on but hey sorry all right show them your hair baby I don't even know if you can see Okay, well that's her hair. It's it's really soft and she has big curls in it. Okay, sweet. Um Yeah, but that's it. So that is our review of the Shea Moisture Baby products um that we tried out. Thanks Kinky Quir Kinky Curly Coily Me for the meetup so we could try the products. Um and that's about it. So we're gonna sign off. <laughs> okay. Say bye, Nia.